Oh, hello. Hello, everyone. Welcome to your next online video lesson. I got a little bit, a little bit of a fright there. i just sort my headphones out. Oh, my God, my hair. Okay, guys. Today, Unit 5, lesson number 2. Okay, on to the second lesson of Unit 5. Let's go full screen. Okay, hope everyone's having a good day, keeping it real, and you are ready for the lesson. Still loading? Where am I? Okay, here I am. Ready. Unit 5, lesson number 2. Let's get started. Now, if you remember, Unit 5 is all about time. What is the time? What is the time? Okay. So before we start, let's go over your five times table because this will be very helpful with you when you are reading, helpful to you when you are reading the clock. Okay, so one times five is five. Two times five is 10. Three times five is 15. Four times five is 20. Five times five, 25. Six times five, 30. Seven times five, 35. 8 times 5, 40. 9 times 5 is 45. And 10 times 5 is 50. 11 times 5, 55. And 12 times 5 is 60. Okay, so here is your 5 times table. Remember this. Practice this. Hopefully you can do this no problem and it's easy peasy. Because this will make reading the clock much more easy for you. Okay. Let's move on to the clock. Okay, so to tell the time, we need to look at the clock. Okay, now on the clock, there are two arms, two arms, okay? You have a small arm or small hand, you could call, we call it a hand. Small hand and you have a big hand, okay? A small hand and a big hand. Okay, now the small one is for the hours. I hope you remember the hours. And the big hand is for the minutes, okay? Because what we want to know, we need to know the hours and we need to know the minutes. That's what we need to know to tell the time. Okay, and this on this clock, we have another hand, a third hand, that is the second hand. But you don't need to know the second hand. That's okay. Don't worry about the seconds. Just remember the hours and the minutes. Don't worry about the seconds. That's okay. Anyway, what is the time? So as I say, when you want to know the time, we're looking for hours and minutes. Easy peasy. Two things, hours and minutes. Okay. So what is the hour? What is the minutes? Okay. So we look at the clock. We did this in the last video. Remember that hours are the numbers on the clock. Okay. The numbers on the clock. And there's 12 of them. Okay. Here they are here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 hours. And these are your hours. Okay, now the minutes, there's more minutes. It's not just 12. Because with the minutes, it's the numbers on the clock times 5. So there are 60 minutes in an hour. 60 minutes on the clock. Okay? Remember, 1 times 5 is 5. 2 times 5 is 10, 3 times 5 15, 4 times 5 20, it's just your 5 times table, okay, to tell the minutes on the clock. Now, let's, let's see if we can do it then. Okay, so, first off, oh yeah, so I gave you the answer, it's 2, because first we look at the small hand for the hours, let's look at the small hand, remember all of this is 2, so that's two. Oh, oh, I was too fast, too fast. So that's the small hand. Tells you two hours. It's two. Now the big hand for the minutes. Here's the big hand. It's pointing at ten. So it's ten times five. What's ten times five? Fifty. The time is two fifty. That clock says two fifty. Okay. And because we know why that is. Because as I say, all of this is two o'clock, okay? Remember, so we draw the little dots. It's still two o'clock. It's not yet three o'clock. 
because all of this is three o'clock. That is all three o'clock. So you can see it is not pointing here at three o'clock. It's pointing here at two o'clock. And then there's four, and then here'd be five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Okay. Let's go on. Okay, are we doing another one? Yes. Okay, we're looking for the hours. We're looking for the minutes. Okay, so let's first we have to look at the small hand. Small hand is here, so it goes here. Yep, there we go. So let's look at that. So that is free. Isn't it? Because da, 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 it's still free. All of this is free. So that is the hour is free. Now we need to tell the minutes. So let's look at the big hand. So the big hand is pointing at five. Okay. So it's five. So what do we do? Is it free five? It's not a free five because you need times by five. So it's five times five. What's five times five? 25. So the time is free, 25. The hour is free. Here's the hour. It's free from the small hand. Then the big hand is pointing at five. So it's 25 minutes. Okay, and that is the time. Okay, now remember, why is it five times? Why do we times by five? It's because these are the minutes. These little lines here are the minutes. Okay, so that's one minute, two minute, three minute, four minute, five minute. So one times five is five, then six minutes, seven minutes, eight minutes, nine minutes, 10 minutes. Two times five is 10. So each of these is five minutes. Okay, so remember that. Okay, let's practice. Let's see if, you're, if, you've, if you've picked that up. Okay, well, let's look at this clock. What is the hour. Let's see if we can figure it out. The hour is pointing here. So what is the hour? That's right, it's two. It's two again. Okay, now we need the minutes. The minutes is pointing at two. So it's, what is how many minutes? Two times five. Ten. The time is two ten. Okay, let's do another one. Okay, this time the small hand for the hours, the small hand is here. So what is the time? Is it 12 or is it 1? What's the hour? Is it 12 or is it 1? That's right, it's 12 because all of this is 12. Okay, so it's 12. The minutes, how many minutes? The big hand is pointing at 6. So how many minutes if it's pointing at 6? 6 times 5 is 30. That's right, so the time is 12.30. Okay, next one. Okay, that's a hard one. What is the time? Let's look at the small hand for the hours. Small hand for the hours is pointing here. So what is the time? Is it seven or is it eight? What do we think? Is it seven or is it eight? That's right, it's seven because all of this is seven. Okay, now the minutes, how many minutes? Big hand pointing at nine. So nine times five. What is nine times five? That's right, it's 45. So 7.45. The time is 7.45. What is the time? The time is 7.45. Okay. Okay, now it's time for you to practice at home. Let's see if you can do it by yourself. It's quiz time, so you know what to do. Can you get a piece of paper and a pen or a pencil? And then can you write one, two, three, four, five? One, two, three, four, five on your piece of paper. Okay. I'll give you 10 seconds and I'm going to start the test. If you need more time, you can pause the video. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one. Okay, are you ready? Okay, number one. Okay, what is going on? Number one. Here we go. Okay, so what is the time? 
that's what I'm waiting for. Here we go. I'm going to give you 30 seconds to write down your answer. Okay. Uh, so I hope you're ready. I'm not going to give you any help, really. So small hand is pointing here. Big hand is pointing here. What is the time? Tell me the hour and tell me the minutes. 30 seconds. Here we go. 30 seconds. I'm sure that is plenty of time. Okay, 13, 13, 12, 11, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, oh. no, nope, alright, this timer is rubbish. Okay, I hope you're ready. You're no more time. You're, I'm, I'm stopping it there. The hour, how many hours? It's one. The hour is one. And the minutes is ten. That's right. So give yourself a tick if you wrote one ten. Okay, that's question one. One ten. Give yourself a tick. Okay. Whoops. What's going on here? No, no, no. Stop. And go. Okay, number two. Let's have a look at number two. Okay, so what is the time? Here's the small hand. The small hand is pointing here, and the big hand is pointing at seven. So what is the time? Whoa! I just I thought that would start the clock. <laughs> I hope you didn't see that. You have thirty seconds to write it down. Okay. Just getting there. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, one, and stop. Okay, the hour. How many hours? What is the hour? The hour was eleven. I hope you didn't see it before. And the minutes. How many minutes? Seven. So 7 times 5 is 35. The time is 11.35. So give yourself a tick if you wrote 11.35. Okay, next one. Nope, sorry. Why is this? I don't want you to do that. Okay, three. Question three. Okay, here we go. Question three, look at the clock. So the hour, what is the hour? The, bit, the small hand is pointing here, so what is the hour? And the big hand is pointing at one, so what is the, how many minutes at one? Okay, 30 seconds starting now, I think, yes. 30 seconds. Again, there are 10 seconds. One, and stop. Okay, what is the time? The hour is eight. And the minutes, how many minutes? If it's at one, just five. So you say eight or five, okay? So the minutes always has to be two digits two digits. So if it's anything less than 10, you have to put an O. You have to put a zero first. So that is 805. I know I didn't tell you that, but now you know. Okay, 805. That is the time. What is the time? It is five past eight. Five minutes past eight o'clock. Okay, so that's number three. I knew it would do that. 
we're not playing this again. We're going to question four. Okay, question four. Let's look at the clock. Small hand first. Small hand is pointing here. Big hand is pointing at the three. So what is the hour and how many minutes? Starting now. Thirty seconds. Five. One, and stop. Okay, and pause. Okay, so what is the time? Small hand is pointing here, and all of this is four o'clock. Then we have the big hand pointing at three. Three times five is 15. So the time is 4.15. What is the time? The time is 4.15. Okay, we have one more question today. We know this is going to happen. It's going to play the clock. And I'm going to say no clock. And then I'm going to go to question five. Please. Question five. There it is. Okay. Question five. Let's look at the clock. We have the small hand is pointing here. And the big hand is pointing at the 10. So what is the time? And I'm going to start the time right now. You have 30 seconds. Last question. Ten seconds. Okay, perfect. Okay, small hand. Small hand is pointing here. It's nearly free. It's very close to free, but it's not free yet. Still two. That is still two. And the big hand is pointing at 10. So 10 times 5 is 50. The time is 2.50. Give yourself a tick if you wrote 2.50. And that is us all finished, guys. I hope everyone got five out of five. If you didn't get five out of five, or if you got, if you didn't get any right, maybe watch the videos again, practice some more. Maybe you've missed something out. But if hopefully everyone did well on that test, I don't. I've started the clock again. No. No, no clock, please. Let's go to our lesson summary once again. Same things we went over. Remember, your big hand is for the minutes. Your small hand is for the hours. Remember the time. When, when someone asks, what is the time? They're asking for the hour and how many minutes. That's what they want to know. And remember, the hours, there are 12 hours, okay? And the minutes, there are 60 minutes, okay? So that's what you need to remember. So thank you once again, guys. That was lesson number two for Unit 5. We're getting through our unit on time hopefully it's becoming a bit clearer for you you're starting to understand how to read a clock next lesson we're going to do a page in the workbook so i hope you're ready for that anyway guys i'll see you in the next video thank you very much for watching have a good day and remember to study 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 and